Hello guys, today we got a look at some new Marvel 2021 sets. So these got released in some random Lego store, and I have no idea why this happened. But we did get a uh, look at one new set, and all of these pictures are HD quality, so that's very, very nice. Also, before I begin the video, I wanted to mention that we just hit 200 subscribers, and I'm really, really grateful for that and all of your support. But now, let's begin the video. So starting off, we have the Captain America and Hydra face-off. It comes with Captain America's bike, which looks really good. Uh, it's really cool for a 4 plus set, much more detailed than the Ninjago 4 plus sets. It comes with two figures, that being like the Hydra agent and then Captain America throwing his shield. There's also a disc shooter in the corner. And this takes place in Age of Ultron, as you can see for the background. Our next set is the Black Panther Dragon Flyer. It comes with Black Panther, Shuri, and a Chitauri Warrior. The build is really cool, and it can fit uh, Shuri and maybe Black Panther? I'm not sure. The Chitauri Warrior is really cool, and the box art is amazing. As we can see from the background, it's based on Avengers Endgame. Our next set is the Iron Man Ironmonger Mayhem. It comes with a really big and scary mech build. Our next set is the Iron Man Iron Monger Mayhem. It comes with Iron Man, Pepper Pots, and Obadiah Stane. Obadiah Stane kind of looks like Thanos who's on the box art. But other than that, uh, the mech looks really good. Lots of Technic pieces, and we get a lot of new minifigures because all of these are exclusive. The, and this set is going to retail for $40, which I think is a fair price, but I'm probably going to wait uh, for it to go on sale before I'll actually get it. Our next set is the Infinity Gauntlet. It's marked as an, a helmet set, even though it's not a helmet. It comes with the Infinity Stones, which are just translucent pieces, and lots of gold pieces, which I really like. So this is a cool set. Uh, I'm probably not not gonna get this unless it goes on clearance or something, but it's a really cool set. And our final set is the Avengers Endgame Final Battle. It comes with Ant-Man, Captain America, Iron Man, Thor, Scarlet Witch, Black Panther, a Chitauri, and Thanos. So Thanos looks really, really cool. He doesn't have a helmet for the first time in big fake form, and he also has studs on his back for some reason. Probably because they're going to use this mold in the future. Next, we also have uh, Captain America wielding Thor's hammer. And the Wanda looks really great. She comes with those flame pieces. And the last time we got a Wanda minifigure was in 2016. So I'm really glad we're getting her again. The Avengers compound looks very close to the one that we got uh, a couple years ago. So I'm not too big of a fan of that. But it's still cool. Maybe if I get if I get this set, I'll probably connect the two sets together, and uh, we'll see what that gets. Uh, this set also includes Ant Man's van, van, which that is cool, and uh, the cannon is also a big cannon on the side. So I think that the set uh, perfectly captures the vibe of Avengers Endgame in the final battle. Again, most of these sets are based off Endgame. But we also get sets from Iron Man 1 and Avengers Age of Ultron. So these sets, they should release August 1st for US and June 1st for all other countries, which is sad, but oh well. Um, I pro if, if I want any of these sets, I'll probably order them on like some website. What do you guys think of these? Tell me in the comments below. And again, we finally reached 200 subscribers. So thank you so much for that. And uh, thanks so much for watching. And I'll see you next time. Bye.